Ooh, no. Something happened in here. Something definitely happened. Oh, no! I freaking knew it. I freaking knew it. I didn't, I didn't even... I didn't want to think it was real, but I freaking knew it. What's up, guys? This is Alex, and you're watching Droopy Poopy, and we are playing... Pray. And when we last left off, we were in the same place, but I did a couple things before this video. I actually restarted the game because I thought it was too easy. I restarted the game and I put it on hard and I'm now using my keyboard because now I can look around better and I'm better at the keyboard anyways. So, I hope you like it. I, I've found a couple secrets in the beginning that I haven't shown you, but it was just like secret emails that I could have found and some other like gadgets and stuff that I could have used or um, picked up on the way. So now I'm in the same spot. I don't know. I haven't played past this part. I'm in the exact same spot. So here we go. I'm going to um, venture forth, I guess. So we had just finished looking at the monster right here. The the big the big bad um, symbiote creature monster thing that was right there. The the one that looked like an actual like being instead of just like weird creatures that are on the floor. So I am not... I'm not going to be happy when I confront that one, that's for sure. Okay, let's see what we got going on here. We've got an elevator, second floor. So I guess this is still part of the simulation because this elevator goes nowhere. Alright, so... We got a health thing? No. Alright, what is this? What the fuck is this shit? What the hell is this? Oh! Oh! Oh, I'm sorry, dude. That sucks. You got fucked. You got severely fucked. I'm... Oh, you look like the elephant, man. What the hell is wrong with you? What did they do to you? Okay, what is all this shit? Glue container? What is this? Oh, it's a gun! What is glue? It's a glue cannon? What the hell is that? What the hell is that even... What does it shoot? Oh. Okay, the Transtar glue cannon gelatin lattice, lattice organism obstructor disables and or immobilizes targets without harming them. Oh, that sucks. I want to harm them. I don't shoot bullets. I don't want a cannon that immobilizes. Fucking piece of shit. Okay, sorry. Glue can extinguish flames and temporarily stop electric arcs. Okay, that's pretty cool, actually. When hardened, glue can also be used as climbable platform. Oh, that's the thing. The, the things I was bashing right now. Press mouse 1 to fire glue cannon. Press and hold mouse 1 to continue stream. Alright, well, I'm, I guess... I think this is, oh, what is this? Oh wait, tutorial, no, no. Wait, tutorial? I don't have the, I think I remember going over there. Um, so I think this is just for, for, that's what I said immobilizing, so I don't think this can kill things. Also, I, my, I can scroll my mouse wheel now instead of, just let me, let me see if there's any secrets that I don't know about here. I can use my mouse wheel to do all that kind of junk to s scroll through my weapons. I'm sorry, it took me a while to get my point across. Eh. I like how he's tired and he can't fucking do it. Okay, there's nothing. I was just wasting my time, I guess. I just like I just like hitting these things I guess I don't know oh whoa 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 oh a little secret up here I guess I don't know oh god there's a lot of them oh no there's a lot normally it's a fake but I swapped in a real one for you the neuromods are critical you won't survive without the hell's a neuromod all new aptitudes I've already updated oh is it like is it like the uh, Adam from Bioshock? What's up, dude? You can't get up here. What do you think this is? This is nothing. You can't get up here. You can't do shit to me. Um, all right. Oh, I'm gonna use my glue cannon. Oh, I can switch with this. I'm gonna try this out. Try this baby out. Aw, oh, you fucking dick. Who else wants some, huh? Huh? Who else wants some? I have a glue cannon. You can't fucking stop me. You can't stop me. Ooh! You got fucking destroyed with that glue cannon. You got destroyed. And again, this is... Oh. Okay. 
Oh god! Fuck you. What? You, you're immobilized. You can't do that. Fuck you, man. That's right. This is pretty cool, actually. I like the glue cannon. What is this? Women's room? Men's room. Oh, okay. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright, alright. Ha! I knew it! Where'd you go? Fuck you. Yes! I'm getting good at this. I'm getting good. See, I'm so much better with the mouse. I can aim properly with the mouse. Fucking stop it! You can't, like... They just, like, turn into things, like, right away. Like, right when I see them, they just turn into things. Oh, shit. This is a bathroom. The bathroom. Anybody in here? I don't, I don't understand what these crumpled papers are. I think, like... What if, what if like, for the crumpled papers, uh, it's gonna be like a thing where it's like, if you have 15 crumpled papers, you now win the game or something, <laughs> like something ridiculous like that. Like, oh god damn it, I should have been collecting those crumpled papers. What the hell was that? Oh, it's like health or something. I don't know. So I'm gonna keep collecting those crump those crumpled papers because I think it's like some kind of um, scrap thing, so I can build things. I don't know. Um, but if it turns out to be like. If you've collected 50 crumpled papers, you now get to kill everybody in one swipe, so. Alright, let's get this Neuromod. Okay. The Neuromod is a revolutionary Transstar invention that allows new skills and abilities. Yep, okay. So it's like the Bioshock Atom and the, the, the Eve that you put in and stuff. Press N to open your Transcribe and navigate the Neuromod section. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, there's like tears and... Alright, what is this? Leverage. Lift heavy objects. I don't need that. Fix broken. Graph shots. Fabricators. I don't know about that. Give me the one that's like health. Knowledge of med pickets. I don't know if I want that. I want like the overall health to be increased. Ooh. Hacking. Hacking is good. If there's nothing else, I'm going to do hacking. Uh... Increase your health. Yep, increase your health to 115 and your stamina to 105. Run, sleep, climb. Okay, so I always, during any game like this, I always boost up my health in the beginning. That's the er You always have to boost your health. That's like the one thing that you must do. Right. Oh. Oh, is it my eye? Oh, God, it's in my eye. Oh, it's like Dead Space 2. Jesus Christ, how did that not kill me? I don't know. Okay, who is this guy? January. Now, Sounds like a girl's name. To the main lobby. Stupid guy. Sounds like a girl's name. Freaking January. Okay. Let's go look around. I know there are more. I'm gonna start just like freaking. Oh, yes! I freaking knew it! I was gonna say I'm gonna start bashing like everything I see. Bashing McBasher. And it's good because I freaking. Uh, I'm gonna bash everything I see. I'm like, I don't trust you. I don't trust you. Yeah, that's right. I don't trust you. I don't trust any of you guys. I don't trust. I don't trust this fucking thing. Yeah, I'm a, I don't trust it. Skill recording room. I want to go in here, record my skills. Um, let me actually. No. Oh. Favorites will allow you to select. Okay, I already know. Uh. Yeah, I already know. Yeah, I already know this. I know this already. I'm gonna say. I was gonna say. Um, I want to see about that side mission that I found last time, so. Um, objectives. Breakout's the main one. What's this? Simmons wrote an email to Jovan Graviolik stating that Bellamy kept some psychoscope research data in a new cabin. Okay, search Bellamy's corpse in trauma center. So that Bellamy is the guy that was a dick to me in the, uh, the testing room or whatever, and he was just like, get me some more coffee, blah, blah, blah. So, I'm going to try to search for him in the lobby when I get in there. Um, get to the main lobby. Okay. 
in the lobby. Okay. All right. Cool. I guess that's it, right? Yep. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I'm ready. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready to fucking die. Are you ready to fucking die? I am. Mysterious contact on January is guiding you to the main lobby. Yeah, January. Hmm. I don't know about January. I feel like like every person that you trust in the beginning, like like Bioshock again. I don't want to be like comparing this to Bioshock. I know I'm I'm comparing it to Bioshock right now, but like in Bioshock, the uh, main guy that was helping you out turned out to be the bad guy. So I don't know. And to be clear, I don't want to. I, le I don't want to compare it to Bioshock and like saying like it's better or worse. It's just, it's the closest thing that rem it's the closest thing to this game. It, like my brain goes to Bioshock when I see this game because it was such a good game and I want to. And every time I see something like it, it's like oh shit, I freaking love this game. I already love it because it's like Bioshock. So, uh, oh, 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 Jesus! I'm sorry, dude. So yeah, I I'm not saying it's better or worse than Bioshock. I'm just saying it's my what it's what my brain goes to when I see something like this. He literally has a wrench. So, I mean, it may be a nod to Bioshock. It might be the new system shock Bioshock. I don't know. All right, let's fucking let's go look around here. Okay, hi. What? What are you talking about? Oh, nice bullets. Thank you. Yeah, dude, this guy's this is like the Elephant Man status. It's like they turn his flesh and his bones and all of his DNA, they take like the, the energy from him and they like, I don't know, it's creepy. It looks like a freaking zombie now. And they just stay like that. Oh, I'm sorry, dude, you still have blood. All right, let's go. Whoa, I freaking knew it. We are in space. What did I say in the beginning? I said this is a space game. I didn't know for sure. Talos one, yeah. I didn't know for sure, but this was a space game. I freaking knew it. I don't trust you. Eh. Yeah, I don't trust you. I don't trust any of this shit. Oh, that is really cool. That's the Earth, and that's the moon. Oh, this is a space station. I'm so freaking excited now. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, man, I'm so... Look at this shit. Oh, I freaking love space. I love space games so much. Oh, Jesus Christ. What the hell? All right. Yeah. Oh, here we go. All right, January. I have a map. There's a video you need to see. I know you have a lot of questions. Yeah. <coughs> I'll take that. Any freaking people things you want to kill me? What the hell are they called? Mimics? Yeah, mimics. Stupid mimics. Yeah, this is the Earth. That's or this is the Earth. That's the Moon. <sighs> so I don't know if I told you, but I absolutely adore space games i love um all all types of space games dead space um scary games like dead space and uh what's it called alien isolation i love mass effect i love space engineers i've played space engineers a lot a lot i love that game and i am myself trying to uh graduate with my bachelor's in engineering and eventually become a space engineer no that's like that would be really, really hard to do. But that would be really cool. Honestly. Okay. Um, damn, look at this freaking huge building. This is a huge building. Huge building. Okay. Um, let's go over here. See if there's anything. Nothing, nothing, nothing. I don't know. All right, I'm not adhering to my advice. I need to... Oh, there's more. There's a neuromod right there. Okay. I don't trust you. Yeah, I don't trust any... Hmm. I'll take that. Oh no! Oh no! Yeah, fuck off! Yeah, fuck off! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Where'd you go? Where'd you go, you fucking bitch? Oh my god, I'm so freaking. They can't just throw him at me like that. Oh, I gotta freaking heal. Where are you? Fuck you! Fuck off! Fuck off, you fucking phantom! Oh God! Oh, ooh, ooh! You've been half awake. What the hell? It was speaking to me. It was speaking to me. What the hell? Oh, damn it. Okay. 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 Take this shit. I'm ready for the phantom. 
Oh, I'm gonna be ready as fuck. Oh, there he is. You can't fucking catch me. You can't catch me. Roar. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Where is he? Where'd he go? 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 Oh, there he is. Ow, ow, ow. Fuck off, you fucking dick. Yeah, you fucking phantom. You can't phantom me. Damn, that was easy. That was pretty easy. Spare parts, recycler charge. What the hell is this? What in the world is this? When detonated, the recycler charge breaks down the molecular structure of nearby objects into recyclable material. Oh. Your uniform offers some degree of protection, but it's not a fail safe. Standing cl too close can prove hazardous. Uh, I'm gonna throw on a fixated station your objects using mouse one. Oh! It's like a bomb. It's a bomb. I don't know what this is. It's like it doesn't let me take any of it. Uh, I'll take that. Oh, nice freaking beats. Boop. So I am gonna keep this for later. Don't think I need that right now. Damn, that was freaking. That was pretty easy, actually. Can I wear this? It's pretty cool. Guess not. Uh, oh Jesus, that's explosive. I don't want. I don't want to hit that. Uh, Drop my dog off the groomer. Her name was Eliza. It means joy. I said goodbye and walked a few blocks to get some cafe bots near the park. Some jets flew over very low, and the sound was so loud it made me jump. I didn't know where they were from, but they were bristling with bombs and rockets. Everybody, everyone was looking up, and the sound of the jets was echoing. Off the buildings, but we were not, but we could not see them anymore. The sky was clear, and I could see pink smoke rising from the direction of the stadium. The sirens started. I had not heard from them since my childhood. Some of the people stood confused, but my instinct told me to run, run away from the stadium, run away from Eliza. Some people were running with me, but we did not, we didn't, we didn't know where to go. I saw a policeman directing people into basement restaurant. I think it was an old bomb shelter. I looked up at the sky again and saw an airliner. It was not military, I'm certain that I think it was an airport while well, we watched something, 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 something. While well, I watched, it turned into glitter without a sound. It was just gone. A man near me began to curse. I fell down and hit my head on the street. Well, damn, that's crazy. It's, evacu it's the evacuation evacuation day. So I don't know what the hell's going on. It. I guess maybe it's not 2032, maybe, I don't know. Cause like that thing, the I don't know I can't I can't I don't want to make any assumptions of what year it is or what's going on I haven't even heard the whole story yet but um, I'm very interested to say the least All right, what is this 1963 oh shit a top secret Cold War negotiation culminates with Americans and Soviets working together on a research facility named Kletka. Okay. Kletka, Russian for cage, produces the skeleton and core emergency systems of what will one day become Talos 1. Hmm, that's really interesting. So, like, maybe this is an alternate universe where more shit was happening in space during the Cold War, not just going to the moon? I don't know. I don't know. Because, like, there could, I mean, maybe it's the same universe and it's just assuming that they built other things in space as well, so I don't know. Let's keep on reading over here. 1964. 1964. After the attempted assassination of Kennedy attempted. and Khrushchev's departure, the U.S. pays for the rights to use Kletka so as a testing facility. This period, known as Project Axiom, leads to many advancements in next generation materials and bioscience fundamental to neural modification. Okay, so it is an alternate universe because Kennedy was definitely assassinated. So this was an attempted assassination. So now that's really interesting because it's like a future or it's like a world where Kennedy wasn't assassinated and the space race even like got even more intense with building more things in space. That's that's pretty cool. All right, that's very interesting. 1980 to 1994. Geopolitical developments result in a temporary hold on Project Axiom. After the unfortunate Poveg incident, in which two research scientists mm. lose their lives, the Kletka facility is decommissioned and cleaned. So this is 1980. More things are happening in space, even more things like... Just because Kennedy was... was president still and he wasn't assassinated, that's pretty cool. Let's keep on going. 
the Transtar Board of Directors is established. Hmm. Transtar purchases and privatizes the Kletka facility with a focus on safety and state-of-the-art upgrades. Okay, so they rebought it after it was decommissioned and whatever. So that's, I mean, this this is in the future for us. <laughs> it might happen. I don't know. Probably not. But you know, one can only hope. Talos One becomes fully operational, representing a monument of private space industry. Okay. The first neuromod is released, allowing for dramatic enhancement to the human mm. mind and body. Okay, so along with this was the neuromods, and all that. So this again, I'm comparing it to Bioshock because I love Bioshock. I'm I'm gonna stop soon, but this is like one of the like the same things like in Bioshock. When they were down there, they were researching on all the um, the fish and the life down there, and they came upon Adam, Adam from the whatever they were researching, and they were able to make those implants and those procedure, those the the necessary things for. <laughs> this is the <laughs> I can't think of anything. They were able to make the powers that they could wield with their hands because of the things that they were researching down there. I'm sorry. <laughs> and that's like the same thing maybe that happened here with the Neuromod, but maybe not in space. Maybe they found something. Maybe they found the black goo or whatever and they were able to make shit with the black goo. I don't know. Let's keep going though. <laughs> I can't make a coherent thought go into my into sentences. Hold on. <clears throat> Good morning, Talos. All personnel should report to their workstations for the day. If you expect to be absent for any reason, please inform your immediate supervisor. Okay, so let's keep going over here. Um. Oh my God. Fuck off. Oh, Jesus, there's a lot of them. There's a shit ton. There is a whole lot of them. Fuck off. Okay. Heh. So, so that was interesting. Keep going. <laughs> okay. All right. So I. Oh man. Am I gonna? Oh shitty, shitty tits. You fucking. Oh, I have to freaking kill this guy again. Fuck off, you fan bitch. You fucking fan bitch. Nineteen sixty-three. Enough of the 1963 bullshit. I'm gonna consume this, and this, and that. Damn, that did nothing. I should invest in the thingy I was, didn't want to invest in. Alright, so let me, let me get, let me get this shit. I already did, okay. So actually, I didn't even use it last time, so I'm gonna use it. Um, maybe I should invest in the health thing. Ooh, but I want secure. I want the... I want this. No, no, I want this. No? No, no, no. I want this. Because, like, it's always good to be have access to computers and turrets and all that. I don't know if it's turrets, if there is any turrets, but I just want access to everything. Hacking. Hacking is hacking is so cool. So I'm gonna do that. Yep. Alright, so this time. This time I'm gonna be ready. Oh this oh shit. Tab does that. Okay. So tab does that as well. Oh, maybe I should throw a bomb? Wait, I don't have the bomb. You didn't give me a bomb? Oh man, I wanted the bomb. Damn it. Okay. I'm gonna be ready for him. Ready. Oh god, he's right there. Oh shit. Shitty shit, shitty 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 shit. Okay, okay, okay. One at a time. One at a time. 
One at a time. One at a time. Thank you. <laughs> Just wasted all this ammo. On some. Ah, ah, the whole party is here. The whole, the gang's all here. The gang's all here. The gang's all here. Oh! scary okay I can't handle groups of them I guess that was that was intense that was intense that was intense oh shotgun shells I'll take that okay I don't trust any of this I don't trust you I don't trust you I don't trust you oh wait I'm gonna eat this I'm gonna eat that I wanna eat it how do I eat it how do I eat it? Um, oh yeah. Mm, I'll just tip them in. Sorry, I don't, I'm not used to the controls. Here we go. Here we go. Here's all the stuff. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use this. No, no, this. Damn it! I'm stupid. Suit repair. Eh, I think it's fine actually. Take that. I think that's fine. Uh, let me actually. That's fine. Okay, we're good. All right. And then let's use this. Okay. Okay. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nice little med pack right here. Okay. Oh, Jesus! I should have been adhering to my own freaking rules about trying to kill everything. Yeah, I don't trust you. Yeah, I don't. Okay, let me just go up here because I think I need to go up there. So I think it's up the stairs. Actually, what's in here though? Security. Before I go in there. key card uh, I need a key card <sighs> I need a key card hmm. or oh I think I found a <gasps> Ooh. oh oh I'm sorry yeah that's the way I think I, I think there's a thing up event up there I could probably go in that'd be cool yeah it's right here oh I'm so freaking smart oh, I'm so smart look how smart I am freaking doing all this shit See how smart I am? I'm freaking smart. What is this? You need a door code to change it. It's 1129. Okay. Thank you. 1129 is a door code. Ooh, yes! Freaking shotgun, yo. Oh, I'm so excited. Let's see. Um. So you just here to uh, witness the incident, and he's pretty shaken. We're not sure how to make an assessment and hold him indefinitely if necessary. Something's on the station, ma'am. You know I went to the doctor about your about sleep and all that. I got pills, but still been seeing things. After game night, I was cleaning up, and a chair moved by itself. Yeah, it's not seeing things. That's actually seeing something that's alive. <laughs> he doesn't know. I'm not crazy like you know like you know who. I'm sending this because I, because just after the alert, I heard. Okay, stop. I can't see. Heard something in the vent over security. I thought I saw something black up there. Yes, it was something. Da it was definitely something black. I need to check this out because I think I'm starting to think that there's something on the station that we don't know about. Uh, yes, you'd be right. Please add Michaela to the watch list while she's currently performing her duties. Her condition makes me makes for a potential security risk, and we may need leverage. Her access should be restricted to work and crew facilities please don't please don't let her anywhere near the labs also flag any communications between her and Gallo, gallegos out of psych psychotronics medical is beginning to suspect that she has white noise so the fact she's falsified her records may be enough normally i'd advocate neuromod removal but her condition prevents this keep me appraised neuromod removal jesus christ okay missing key card 
Sarah, I need your help tracking down the missing key card. This should be one of your highest priorities. It's labeled EP101. Let me know as soon as you find anything. Okay. So that's... Alright, so I need these... Trying to find the security key card, maybe? Judges, her hand went to the tent peg. Okay. She smelled through it. Whatever. Yeah, okay. Thank you. It's just religious um, connotation or something. I don't know. Right? Something. Song of Deborah. Filing cabinet. What is this? Day two. I woke up on the streets and M30. Okay, so the evacuation day two. So it was from the first one. Now it's the second one. An M35 truck was stopped near me and with the drivers yelling at me to get in. There were several people in the back already. Four or five soldiers and about a dozen civilians, including children. I got in the truck and someone gave me a bottle of water. I asked what was happening and the soldier just shrugged. I told them I had driven the M35 during my service. People in the truck were, try were crying and I looked back. The pink smoke was now mixed with gray and swirled high into the sky. There was so much of it and it seemed to cover the entire city. We kept picking up people until the truck was full. Before we got to the highway, we heard shooting. The soldiers climbed down and readied their weapons. The commander told me to drive the truck as far as possible to the west and they ran toward the shooting. Holy shit. So I'm not sure what evacuation this was. Maybe it said during the first thingy that I, I skimmed through. I don't know. So maybe it's of Earth of something. That's why they were here. I don't know. But it sounds pretty intense. Oh, what is the key? Is it? Oh, wait, wait. Is it the safe key or is it the other one? What was... How do I... Mm. Uh, data. Stand up notes. No. No. Holding room, eleven twenty nine. Okay, 1129 is for the holding room, not for the safe. I need the safe one. No safe one. Okay. So I am... I really... I really like the shotgun, because look at the... Oh, look at the ammo on the side. It just shows you exactly the amount of... Oh, future weapons are so cool. Okay. So I'm going to assign this to... Three... Yeah. I'm going to assign it to three. That sounds good. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, two. Oh shit, sorry. Thought I put it on airplane mode, but I guess I didn't. Alright, let's keep going. Alright, here we go. Ooh, no. Something happened in here. Something definitely happened. Oh no! I freaking knew it. I freaking knew it. I didn't, I didn't even... I didn't want to think it was real, but I freaking knew it. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Miss Elazar. I don't know what I saw, but I just... I was just trying to do my job. Now I, might, now I worry I might not get a chance to talk to you, so I'm writing this. Don't I don't recall the last time I was scared, but what happened in Sim. I can't get it out of my head. Whatever is happening, I want to help. Not sit here in this room. I'm starting to feel like people on the station haven't been shooting straight. Like what, is, like, what do they actually do in psycho Psychotronics? No one I talk to goes in there. And you and Yuri Kimura has an unnumbered has unnumbered neuromods in her office and that I thought you should know about. Okay, so I should probably go to that office. That sounds pretty good to me. Yuri Kimura. So I got a new objective, too. Okay. Uh, what is this? Ooh, what is this? Oh, hell yeah, area map. Cool. Awesome. Alright. Emails. Help, 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 help. Now, Elias, anyone help? 
Please help us, please help us. Yada yada. Morgan used office keypad. What is this? Set up a recurring task for Morgan's keypad. We're getting a code change re request every month. It's the same pattern. Morgan asks us what the current code is, ask if it has if it was requested or if we choose it. Then asks for a new one. It's unusual. Last time he asked, I was right there. So I told him the code and gave him a blank look. A code we'd set less than a like less than a week ago. Maybe he's testing our response time. Ooh, so Jesus. What is this? Oh shit. Missing crew? Oh man. Oh my god, there's a lot. Oh, but these are like no life signs. Holy shit, this is a lot. Okay. I'm gonna go to the lobby one. And what is this? Carolyn Wheeler, an off station. Darcy Maddox. Daisy White. What? Already found Bianca. Okay, that's already found her. So I'm gonna try to find Darcy Maddox because she seems like she is alive and I want somebody who's alive. Character sheet. <laughs> that's pretty funny. Um, character name Captain Stabfellow. <laughs> Captain Stabfellow. Uh, something black, 6-2, strength is 17, 6, intelligence, 15, dexterity, 14, constitution. That's funny. Somebody was playing. Uh, huh. Okay, so I just unlocked it. I didn't even need the key card. The key cord. So I don't, I didn't find the code for this. Uh, alright. Maybe I'll find it later. Who knows? Okay, all right, let's go upstairs So I feel like that's where I'm supposed to go to advance the story and make Hello Oh, I don't trust you one bit Oh, that's pretty cool. Well, nope alas. It's nothing. I Like I like that shotgun. Oh I think it's you Ah! I found you! I freaking found you, you fucking piece of shit. That's right. Freaking stupid bitch. Oh, thank you. Oh, key card matching. Is there an event? Okay. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Okay. Can't go in here. Oh. Oh, there's a freaking gun in there. I want the I don't want to go in there. I want to go in there. Teleconferencing conferencing room. Executive offices. Bianca Goodwin. Oh, Bianca. Okay. Oh, there's, oh, there's a turret. Is that a friendly turret? I think it's a friendly turret because it's green. Okay, okay, I think we're fine. Ooh, trauma center. I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll take it. What is this? I'm going to need some more support. Volunteers are agitated more than usual. This morning, Eleven threatened to bash my head in if it didn't let me out to stretch my legs. When you get up here, the key code is 7496. Okay, 7496. Not the old number on file. I'm pretty sure they've been watching me punch that again. Okay. Oops, sorry. Oh, that's a lot of stuff to read. Dr. Igwe. I relayed your previous request and we'll see what we can do, but there are no guarantees. The schedule for the visit is tight and my and may not allow for a face to face. I'll let you know when I have more details. Sincerely Bianca Talos one the volunteer and guest liaison. So I think Bianca Goodwin was one of the people I had to find. Miss Goodwin, to follow up on the previous request, I was wondering I'm sorry. I was wondering if there had been any updates on Gustav Leitner's visit. It is, it, is it still taking place? And if so, we would be possible to get a proper of his itinerary. I would love a chance to meet him before the neuromapping procedure if possible. Okay. Yeah, Igwe showed up. Quiet and polite. He shook Leitner's hand and was he was afraid of breaking him. Okay. <laughs> Asked him to sign an album he'd bought. Leitner seemed flattered, so that was a plus. We tried to make him comfortable. His condition wasn't hasn't stopped from him having a craving for a cigarette. Figures were twitching. Too bad, such talent. No wonder he's gotten. He wanted to get scanned. Helen. Okay. 
So, more story, more things to know. Okay, all right, all right. All right I'm trusting. I'm trusting this turret's not gonna kill me. Okay, he's fine. He's the turret's fine. Turret's absolutely fine. I don't know why I was freaking out. No reason to. Okay. Staff, please move these remaining boxes to my new office in Neuromod Div as soon as possible. Sylvain, I'm trusting you with my brain. <laughs> oh, okay. You do you do good work, so hopefully that continues. Winky face. Ooh. Listen, if tests don't go well, if something happens, let Alex know that I know it wasn't my his fault. I signed up for this. Also, if the tests drag on, consider moving your office down to Sim. Less hassle, and you can always move back up after we celebrate our success. From Morgan to Sylvain. So that's from me. Okay. So I did some sort of procedure on my brain? Let's read this, actually. The nature of consciousness remains deeply mysterious. How can the subjective nature of experience, my inner life, be explained in scientific terms? Does consciousness emerge from complex computations among brain neurons, or is it fundamental and irreducible property woven into the fabric of the universe? So, string theory. Okay. Let's keep going over here. That's a pretty good turret. Oh, shit! Oh, thank God. Hell yeah. 0451. Cool. No password found. Oh. Typhon material. 0451. 04. Oh, sorry. 451. This is my office. Oh, this is my office. Ooh. So I guess I was here before. This has been your home for the last three years. Three years? Be on your workstation. Three years? Why? Jeez. Oh, thank you. Three years. Holy shit. Alright, let's look at this shit. What is this? Morning, Morgan. I got the plan you requested. Is it in your safe? Jason. Cool. Thanks, Jason. Okay. You made it, Yum. I still don't know what happened. I put you behind me. I put it behind me, but there's no reason we can't be civil. You passed me in the hallway today, and you looked through me. If you're angry at something I did, tell me. We can talk about it. Pretending you don't even know who I am isn't going to help. We still have to work together. Mika. Okay, sounds like a lover or something. Morgan, as requested, your terminal logs are set to be automatically forwarded to your suite and crew quarters. Okay, let me know if you get all right. If you if you are all right, let me let me know if they get to you all right. And if not, I'll get it resolved. Like last week, I'll make sure you aren't disturbed in the interim. Let me know if there's anything else I can do. Hold down. I'll hold down the fort in your office, Jason. So my secretary, maybe. And this sounds like some somebody I knew. And maybe with the brainwashing or something, maybe, I don't know what's happening to me. Um, I don't know her anymore, so take this Neuromod. Three Neuromods? Fuck yeah. Okay, let's watch this shit. Ooh. Ooh! I'm ready. What's going on? Oh! Here we go. Okay. Hello, oh shit, that's me. Tough day, right? Yeah, very tough. If I'm talking to myself, it must be. Now, your memory's shot full of holes. I know. I'm sorry, but it's permanent. So the first thing you need to know is you can trust January. It's an operator, a sort of mm. backup of you and me. Oh. It knows what you've forgotten. Oh, We've been okay. testing a new kind of neuromod based on the Typhon organisms, I mapping it. their neural patterns it. onto ours. Problem is, yeah, when you uninstall kill you. a neuromod, it resets your memory back to the moment you first put it in. Oh shit! That's why you forget. Oh, There's supposed God. to be a process to bring you back up to speed between test runs, but someone could just skip that part, turn a single day into your entire life. Well, that's exactly what Alex did. Oh shit! The question is, why? Yeah, why? <laughs> 
You're not gonna like what I have to say next. Why? Whoa! What's going on here? What in the hell is going on? Okay. Can we turn on the lights again? I don't like this. Oh shit. Man, fuck you. Fuck off. Damn it, you picked up the key card. Okay. Well, turn the lights back on, please. If you could. If you could. Okay. Yep. Will do. I'm looking for another way to help you in the meantime. Thanks. Good luck. Thank you. Awesome. Damn, this game is really good. Ooh, shit. This is my office, yo. Look at my office. Oh, shit. Blue cannon fabrication plan. Weapon upgrade kit. Oh, hell yeah. Look at this. Look at my family. Oh, God. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. I don't like that. Look at all this shit. Freaking, what is this? Fabricator? Oh, hell yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna do this on the next episode, by the way. Oh, fuck yeah. I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna take that, I'm gonna take that, I'll take that. And I'll take that, I'll take that, I'll take that, and I'll take that. I'm gonna look through all this stuff in the next episode, because I have to end it here anyways. But let me just look around to see if there's anything on the surface. Oh, shit. Oh, the shotgun that I got from the pre-order. Hell yeah. Oh, this one looks so much cooler. Hell yeah. I'm gonna take that. Take that. Take that. What the hell is this? Makes you immune to recycler charges. Oh, it's for my suit. Oh, cool. Alright. Shotgun shells. Material, material. Awesome. <sighs> okay, well, I'm gonna... This gun is so cool. Oh, it has eight rounds too. Okay, I'm gonna use this one instead of the other one. But I'm going to stop it here. God, this game is so fucking weird. It's so cool, but it's so weird and it's so cool. <gasps> oh, I like it. I bet I like it. Oh, yes. Okay. Hope you liked it. And if you did, press that like button and comment on uh, what I'm doing wrong, what I'm doing right, what you think is funny, what you think is scary, what you think is cool, all that good stuff. And don't forget to subscribe to me. Thanks for watching. Love, peach, chicken, grease. Peace in the Middle East, and I'll see y'all later. later.